Hey, how you doing? I hope you're doing well. I feel very called. I actually pulled over um, at a really beautiful cemetery near where I live. I pulled over to do this reading. It was so, and we have the cards. <laughs> okay. It was just like I had to. So we have three of swords, four of swords, five of swords. Okay. I shuffled these. I'm just a little flabbergasted at the moment. And then we have seven of pentacles and ten of pentacles. So what spirit's telling me here, this is really bizarre. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 7, 10. Okay. This is significant. Thank you for giving me a moment in my, in my awe struckness. You feel like you're late. You feel like you've been doing the steps too slowly. You feel like you have missed the boat like you've missed the golden opportunity and you're frustrated right now you're very frustrated right now because you've been doing the work man you're like spirit i've been putting in the work i've been doing everything you asked me to do and it's still not enough I'm going to miss the boat. I'm not enough. I haven't done enough. I haven't gone hard enough. I haven't accomplished enough. <laughs> now I'm laughing because this is just already blowing my mind how they've done this. Seven of pentacles. Yeah, we see you. We see you. Spirit sees the long, cold, like a seven year long winter, okay? And in that winter time, you've been doing the work to be ready for the moment when you could finally sprout, when everything thawed and the sun came out and you could bloom. And they're letting you know here that you're already there. That's what I'm hearing. You're already there and you've been, oh gosh, oh, my heart feels you because you have been in such this um, hustle, make it happen, get it done, be the one. You have been in this energy for so long now that it's almost like, you're, you can't step out of it. And look what just fell out <laughs> down into my car seat, the chariot. It's like you're afraid to actually get in the driver's seat for your new life because it still feels like, what is this here? Yeah, dude. Nine of cups, but it came out in the reverse because you still feel like this must be another trial, another trial or tribulation that I have to get through in order for my abundance to come in, in order for me to make it to that timeline in time. 420 on the clock, and for some reason that's important. You're already there. And I feel such a mothering, like I don't normally say these kind of things, but I feel like I need to tell you, you're already there, baby. Look at what's underneath. Ten of Cups. You're already there, baby. It's kind of like coming back from... Now, I'm not even going to pretend like I know what coming back from a war is in my lifetime. That is not something I've experienced. 
but the energy they're giving me is almost as if someone who has come back from fighting a years long war and they're still so in the energy of fight or flight that they can't get their nervous system to ground and they can't really get themselves to feel grounded in their present moment that they're no longer fighting that that's not the energy that they're in anymore and uh, you don't have to rush yourself that's what they're saying you don't have to rush yourself right now the first step is acknowledging that the war is over that's a big one that's a big one i'm sorry I'm using a mushroom deck, but and this is the hermit card, but this immediately reminds me of an atomic bomb, and here is this light. You, you're you stuck in a moment. I'm hearing, stuck in a moment, but I can't get out of it. I think that's you too. You're stuck here, but really you're behind the, your viewpoint is actually behind this this guiding light and that's the energy you're hanging out with now but you can't get out of this moment and they're just saying all you got to do right now is <laughs> all you have to do right now is recognize that it's safe that you're safe now that you've always oh i'm getting so emotional you have always been so divinely protected through all of your battles and all of your trials and tribulations and you're here you're already here it's just gonna take you a little bit to acclimate to it so this is just a quick message to be gentle with yourself hopefully this is a confirmation and a validation from spirit and your spirit team that the worst is over and I'm sending you so much love and blessings and happiness as you move ahead and through your day. Namaste. I love you so much.